Hey guys, what's up? It's V War, and welcome to episode 2 of my NBA 2K15 Clippers Association mode. Last time you saw us take on the Golden State Warriors and lose in overtime. And now we're going to be playing game 2 of the season, which will be our home opener against Detroit. Let's go ahead and get into it. You see the beautiful New Los Angeles skyline there. Nice, see Blake Griffin doing some pull-ups on the rim like he always does pre-game to get pumped up for the game. And now we see Chris Paul getting pumped. He looks ready and then high-fiving his teammate who is a just a bit taller than him. And now he's going to give him some handshakes to the Pistons. Chris Paul getting his, himself and his teammates ready to play. And here we go. Opening tip-off just seconds away. And we are underway here in Los Angeles. The, the Pistons win the tip-off. And I thought Chris Paul got fouled there. But no call. He drives to the rim and puts it in. Detroit with the early 2-0 lead. And then Chris Paul going to take the ball down the court. He's going to look for something. And he finds opening himself, takes it. Doesn't make it, but he is fouled. The first free throw will fall to make it 2-1 with another free throw on the way. And here comes his second free throw to tie the game to a piece. And the second free throw is good. So that ties the game 2-2. Now the Pistons with the ball once again, taking it up the floor. He's looking for something. He's going to pass it out to Drummond. He's going to go back behind the arc, almost. Finds nothing, passes it up to Smith. Finds Jennings for three. It is no good. DeAndre Jordan with the rebound. DeAndre Jordan playing strong in the post. And get, gets it to J.J. Redick, who gets blocked. What an ugly shot. But no matter, we get it right back without giving up any points. Chris Paul for three. It's good. And that gives us the 5-2 lead. Now Jennings taking it up the court for Detroit. Looking for something to happen. He's going to come off the screen. Finds Meeks for three. It's good. And that ties the game at five apiece. Now Chris Paul bringing it down the floor. Trying to make something happen. He's looking. Finds Barnes. Who's going to drive in? Kick it out to Paul. Fakes a couple times. Gets it to Barnes again who shoots. And it is good. That makes it seven to five. Now Jennings taking it up the floor. He's looking for something at the top of the key. And he sets and his teammate sets the screen for him. He puts a shot up. It's no good, but he is fouled. And he ends up making one of those. So now Chris Paul taking it down the floor. He's looking for something to happen. Gets it to DeAndre Jordan, who's going to try driving in. Can't find anything. Gets it to J.J. Redick, who gets it to DeAndre Jordan. DeAndre Jordan puts it. Looking to put it up himself, but gets stolen. And Smith going down the floor, uncontested for the dunk. That makes it 8-7. to seven. And now, just like that, Meeks this time going down the floor. And he slams it down. That makes it 10-7. And here, the Det Detroit now on offense. The big man down the post puts it in. That makes it 12-7. And just like that, what was a... A one-point lead for the Clippers has turned into a 14-8 Piston lead. With time running down here in the first quarter, Pistons with the ball. If get it, they get it with outside the three-point line. Augusta wide open for three. It's no good. Meeks with the rebound. Nobody in his way puts it back up. 16-8 is the score. Six seconds left before the end of the first quarter. And Crawford for three. It's good. With .3 seconds remaining in the quarter, and Detroit is just going to run it out, and that is the end of the first quarter. Here at the start of the second quarter, the score is Detroit 16, Clippers 11. Clippers will be getting the ball first. Crawford bringing it up the floor. He's going to look and try to find something. Finds Farmar. He's going to drive in. Finds nothing. And with a three-point game. Augusta at the key, 
finds wide open man for three. It's good. Now the score 25-16. Wilcox driving in. And I'm sorry, the game's getting a little glitchy. But now you see the score. Detroit 25, Clippers 16. A minute and a half to go before the halftime break. And, this, and we get the steal there. Crawford bringing it up the floor. He puts it up and in. Score now 25-18 with a minute and 13 to go. Eventually we have it 27-18 with 30 seconds to go before the break. Chris Paul finds finds Crawford. Who finds Paul? He puts it up for three. It's good. 27-21 is the score. 25 seconds to go before half. Jennings bringing it up the floor. He's going to look. At the top of the key, looking for something to happen. Gets it. Gets it to Monroe, the big man down in the post. And he's going to get to Jennings for three. It's no good. Barnes with the rebound. Five seconds to go. He gets it to Crawford. I was looking for Paul, but he was out of bounds, so Blake Griffin puts it up from deep three. No good. That's the half. The score at halftime, Pistons 27, Clippers 21. And here we go, the start of the third quarter. We get the ball first. Chris Paul going to bring it up the floor. He gets it to J.J. Redick, who drives in. Back out to Chris Paul for three. It's no good. And they get the rebound. Oh, Chris Paul to J.J. Redick. J.J. Redick driving in. See if he can find anything he can't. Behind the back pass to Barnes for three. Good. Now that was a beautiful play. If we'd seen more of those, we wouldn't be losing right now. But just a lot of lazy basketball here. We're into the fourth quarter now. DeAndre Jordan with a nice slam there. But this game has just not been going our way. The score is now 51-39 with a minute to go. We have just not been playing some good basketball. We've had a lot of lazy plays. You see there, he puts it up, and it won't fall, but see, lack of hustle on the boards. They get it right back. And 50 seconds to go. We get it to J.J. Redick, who finds Barnes. He just desperately puts up a three. It won't fall. And Jennings with 45 seconds to go before the end of the game. He's bringing it up the floor. Get it to Smith. Smith looking to make something happen. J.J. Reddick gets it out of bounds. Clippers ball. But it will have mean nothing. The game 53, 39, 35 seconds to go. Bringing it up the floor to Bullock. He puts it up from three. It won't fall. They get the board. And that. With, and then we have 19.2 seconds remaining in the game. Martin looking. Gets it to Augustine. Augustine is going to drive in. Gets it to his man. And he puts it in. Nothing going our way today. A lot of lazy basketball. A lot of lucky shots on, their, on Detroit's part. And we put up one last ditch three. It falls. But it will mean nothing. They're just going to run down the clock. And that will do it. The final score, Pistons 55, Clippers 42. A horrible game. We are going to have to play better than that if we want to win in this league. Pathetic game on our part. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. See you later. Bye.